Good morning. Today's topic is how to start a home business. Hi, I'm Sherry Kirkland and it was my heart's desire to start a home business years ago and I realized very quickly that I wanted more choices in life and that the solution to more choices in life was more dollars in my pocket. When I looked around, I saw that people who had plenty of money often had their own business. So I went on a search to find out how to start a home business. And what I found out and what I can share with you today can save you years and years of searching and heartache. You may have seen this before. This is um, called the Cash Flow Quadrant. It's by Robert Kiyosaki, who's written many, many great books on home-based business. Um, but he talks about um, in life, when you're um, getting money, you're doing it one of four ways. You're either an employee and you have a job, or you're self-employed, where you basically own your own job, or you're a business owner. You allow systems and people to work for you, and those are the people who you know you probably work for if you're in a job, and then you have money working for you or you're an investor. Now this is where I want to really get into the nitty gritty here. <laughs> if you're an employee, you're just really trading your time for money, and if you want to make more money, you have to spend more time working. Most of the time you're limited to 40 hours a week, um, you know, even you could work 80 hours a week, but beyond that, you know, you have to eat and sleep. <laughs> so you're very much limited in the amount of money that you can earn. And, you know, you could get a better job with a higher salary, but it just, it doesn't scale up quick enough for most people. And typically if you, you know, get sick or go on vacation or lose your job, that, that cash flow typically stops. Um, when you become self-employed, you work by yourself, but also for yourself. You know, you can think about plumbers, electricians, uh, pest control people, a lot of, you know, the people that you see in your own hometown that, that run a service company. Maybe they're a welder, or maybe they're a, a furrier, they put horseshoes on horses. You know, they have a, a certain trade skill, but they're, it's dependent on them. You know, if they get hurt or disabled, you know, they're out of business and that income stops for their family. The third one is, is really why I really want you to focus in. These are business owners. Business owners typically own a system and they have people working for them. And it's no longer their hours that bring them an income, but the system they have set up. The best example of this is the franchise system. You think about McDonald's or Chick-fil-A or Subway. A lot of times, you know, the, the business owner will purchase that franchise for a large amount of money. I'm going to show you some of that in a minute. And they, they bring in people, you know, pay the minimum wage to work the system. The system is what drives the business. It's a proven system. And it allows those business owners time freedom. When their system is up and running, they can, you know, sneak away for a long vacation if they want to, or if they get sick, it's okay. Their business continues to run. And rather than diving into your own business as the self-employed person, I want you to begin thinking about the possibilities of being a business owner. And then as you earn money in your business, that passive income you can begin to become what we see in the fourth quadrant, an investor. This is where you allow your money to work for you. There's no activity, it's a passive income. It, it, you know, it could be real estate, stocks, or um, some of the other categories of investment where you, you basically let your money work for you. So when you talk about being a business owner and owning a franchise, let me just show you some of the top franchises. I wonder if you've ever seen a slide like this and if you understand the kind of upfront capital that's required to start something like this. Look at Subway. I know that there's a Subway in just about every single town in the United States. You're looking at, you know, four and actually five figures. Uh, I 
think this says here, 36 to $262,000 to start a subway. You look at Jiffy Lube, $196,000 just to open your door. Supercuts, $103,000 just to open your door. This pretty much puts a lot of people out of the running for something like this. Look at McDonald's, $1 million just to get started. I know that puts me out, and I'm sure it probably puts you out too. But I want you to know that there's a much better way. You can really literally get started for less than $100 a month and own your own franchise. And what's really cool is that you have the potential for absolutely more time freedom and more money than some of the owners of these types of businesses that you see here. I guarantee you that we have people in our system, in fact I know one of them, who probably makes more than the owner of any of these franchises that you see listed here. And he's my mentor and he does it quietly from the comfort of his home. He doesn't have to go to his subway store every day and deal with the headaches of employees and hiring and firing and uh, dealing with the ordering of the products and uh, all the headaches that come from a brick and mortar business. So let me kind of show you what that looks like and what the benefits are. In the franchise system that I'm going to tell you about, you get to work from home. You can literally work in your pajamas. I am sitting in my pajamas right now. <laughs> you get to choose your own hours. You get to go at your own pace. There's no employees. I didn't list that here, but uh, there's no employees to manage. No, um, no salami and bologna and lettuce and tomatoes to order for your Subway sandwiches. Um, there's nothing to stock. No no physical products that you have to stock in your garage. No cold, cold calling. Uh, we actually, you know, are in a situation where people call you when they're ready to get started. It's pretty cool. Um, and I forgot to mention a global presence. You're not limited to your hometown or even your state or your country. We have a global presence and we, we are able to connect with people all over the world. As a home-based business owner, you have great tax benefits. You get to, you can literally almost receive extra money in your pocket just from being able to, du to deduct your business expenses. Oftentimes those are expenses you're already paying for, your home office, your electricity, your phone, your cell phone, your internet access. You can actually just put money back in your pocket from those great tax benefits alone. All you need is a computer, the internet, and maybe a phone. I say maybe because we have people earning, you know, six figures monthly and they never pick up the phone. They never answer their phone, never pick up the phone. There are other ways to communicate that are much more effective. And our system that we're able to provide for you is already set up. You just have to plug in, learn a few new skills, and take action on a daily basis when you're getting started. Once you get your home-based business up and running, you can literally walk away for short periods of time or even long periods of time. And it's nice to know that you can have the potential uh, income, the income potential to actually walk away and be on a vacation or doing something that you've always wanted to do in your life. So we have an income disclosure statement and you'll see that later. Um, but you actually have the potential for a full-time plus income in just a few hours per day. And I hope that sounds attractive to you because that's what's attractive to me. When I was looking to start my own home-based business, you know, I wanted the time freedom. I didn't want to, you know, buy myself a job and run a brick-and-mortar business that was open, like a, you know, a retail store that's open from 9 in the morning till 9 at night, 7 days a week. That simply wasn't attractive to me. I wanted to ebb and flow and flex according to my lifestyle, according to my family schedule. And, uh, you know, what I found online has met those desires. And I feel pretty certain that they'll meet your desires too. And I want you to continue watching and take action at the end of this video. So what are the steps to start a home-based business? I have literally boiled this down to just a few pieces of information. 
you want to co connect with an online franchise system. And we have literally boiled it down to a simple science. We, we have, you know, spent years of struggling ourselves, and we know what works and what doesn't. And we're willing to share that with our people. Um, and we'd be willing to share that with you. You gotta connect with a mentor, someone like me, who cares about your success. That is absolutely critical. I'll tell you that when I first got started, I did connect with some mentors, but they weren't sharing the right information with me, and I struggled for the first seven years. And just in the last year, I've connected with an amazing mentor who's given me the right information and allowed me to reach my destiny and meet that success that I was destined for. This is so important, you guys listening. You've got to connect with a mentor and a group of people who care about you. And it, after that, it's just simply learning. Um, begin learning how to become one of those millions of people around the world quietly earning fortunes from home and creating their own economy. Uh, yes, you'll have to learn. Yes, you'll have to study. It's no different than you know going to to a school, a university, or going through the school of hard knocks. You have to go to school. But what we have to offer you is available online from your computer, 24 hours a day, seven days a week, 365 year, days a year. You know, you plug in at your own pace and at your own time. It's simply amazing. And I want to leave you with this quote. Wisdom comes from only two places your mistakes or your mentor. Which do you prefer? And it's like I said, you learn from school or you learn from the school of hard knocks. And um, I, I hope that you'll see that by connecting with me as a mentor that I can help you collapse time frames. You don't have to spend that seven years struggling like I did because I now know what works and what doesn't and I share that with you. It's so easy, and I can't wait for you to see how easy it is. So, again, I want to thank you for spending a few minutes of your precious time with me. I realize that your time is precious, and so is mine. And my wish for you today is that you'll connect with your purpose, live your passion, and never, ever, ever give up on your dreams. There's a link just below this video in the description area, and I want you to click that link Put in your name and email address, and that will connect you with me and my team of caring leaders. You'll get an email almost immediately in your inbox with some directions to get started. So don't waste. I want you to stop struggling and, and really get off on the right start. Get started today. I hope to see you on the inside. Have an awesome day. This is Sherry Kirkland. Bye for now.